Hello, people. This is the Black Love Gamer. And my last review had me thinking about the days when I first got my vibe. Back in 2016. Yeah, one of the games that I was able to play on the system, it wasn't the best of systems at the time, was Cyberpunk VR, which is more like Breakout. <laughs> Yeah, um, I was I always jumped into the single player mode because multiplayer it wasn't really anybody playing it, so I never got to experience like actually playing pong with somebody. So as far as the single player mode's concerned, it's an endless mode. You're always even if you miss getting the ball back, you're always going to get another ball. The whole thing that you're supposed to do is to keep the blocks from reaching this little laser off love well the thing that divides you from where the blocks are the blocks reach there it's game over so your whole goal is to see just how long you can keep the blocks at bay now when you do hit the ball onto the blocks they do certain things or the blocks will have certain characteristics like the red blocks would explode purple blocks will um would release an energy ball and you can do various things once you build up your uh, energy from the energy balls. Uh, the blue blocks need more than one strike in order to uh, crack them all the way open. Orange blocks, I believe, was normal. So with the energy from the blue balls that would come out of the purple blocks, you could either um, use a pistol. It'll be like a pistol will appear in your hand or, or in both if you, you know, want to use it. You would use the um, the trackpad to select which ability you wanted. So you had the pistol. You had like a uh, you can make the paddles bigger. That made it easier to hit the ball. You could have a gravity gun because when you hit the oh the green blocks, the green blocks let out another ball. So if you have a whole bunch of green blocks and you're hitting the balls, it's like you're you're everywhere. So you can like use the gravity gun thing to suck all the balls and then shoot them out at one time and cause chaos it would just be utter chaos on the screen and then you would have the uh it would be like a little rocket launcher gun but you would have to get a whole bunch of like it would use up your whole your entire energy store for the um rocket launcher it blows up all the bricks in the end but yeah that's basically it so like i said it was just something for me to play uh, at, at times it would be my little workout because I would just try because I wasn't even using the power ups. It would just be all paddle. So I'm trying to see how long I can stay in for. And it might be like 20 balls bouncing around. I'm trying to hit all of them. Yep. But I'm not sure if this is really I, it was just something I wanted to talk about and how I felt when I got the game. Like I just uh, showed Baby J. I showed her how to play. So the first gameplay footage was of her. That's why you could barely, you could barely, uh, she could barely hit anything. It was funny. But um, yeah, that that was my go-to game. I mean, it it did what it it did what it was supposed to do at the time. Like now, you know, it's you know other things I would prefer to play. But this was just something that brought back memories. I was all you know that had me all hype and. This was one of the games that I would show off to people if they wanted to uh, see VR. You know, it wouldn't be too much. It would kind of, like, I would probably put it as far as, like, not, it's not like Beat Saber, but it would be a go-to for Beat Saber. It wasn't a whole bunch of zombies coming at you. Um, I guess it would be a, considered, like, a slower-paced pirate trainer because, some you know, some people couldn't take pirate trainer when you play. Okay, I went a whole bunch of different places that I don't even know why I went to them. Okay, there's going to be more videos coming. I had a lot of stuff going on, and so I will be editing things. And I will be having Little J talk trash about me in one of the videos that will be coming up. It should be coming up next. I, I got some things to add into it. All right, Black Glove Gamer is out.